Welcome to this uh, Windows Computer and Technology channel. Somebody asked me if uh, there was a way to check for uh, activity on a, uh, a Gmail account or a Google account um, as he suspects that maybe somebody else is actually signing in to his account. So, yes, you can check out the activity. You have all of the activity available. I want to remind everybody, it's extremely important to have two-factor authentication turned on. Today, it's a minimum, and it can send you a code uh, by text message. It can even call you on the phone if you don't have uh, text message capabilities. And you can use an authenticator app also, which is even more secure than text message. But two-factor authentication lowers the risk of having anybody uh, get into your accounts uh, totally. I mean, if somebody tries to get into your account, you'll get a secret code or you'll get an, an alert, which is um, preventing that person from accessing the account. So when you go to your account, you go to your Gmail, go in the upper right, you'll see your avatar or just a letter, depending on what it is. You go here. This is an account made just for showing um, what we do. And in here, you'll go to manage your account. And manage your account, you will have on the left side security. And security will bring you into the security page. The first thing you'll see is recent security activity. If you've signed in or somebody tried to sign in, sign in from some other device, you'll know here. Here's going to say, okay, try to sign in on a Chromebook. Try to sign in on a smartphone. And it's going to tell you the smartphone. It's going to tell you what model. Uh, try to sign in into Windows. Any activity that is out of the ordinary, because it won't show you're signing in. It's going to show you only what is unusual and of new types of activity. And that's what you want to see, because that is going to show up here if somebody's trying to log into your account. The other thing is down this page, you will also have the devices you're logged in with. Check these devices. Make sure if you have old devices you don't use anymore that you will somehow remove the Gmail accounts from these old devices. Um, check the list to make sure that the devices you're signed in are devices you know about that are yours. Uh, that will also give you an idea about the activity on the account. Now, what happens if that you kind of, there's something unusual happening? I'm going to make a separate video because that video will probably uh, help out a lot of people with its title. So what do you do when uh, the uh, account is maybe compromised? If you're not sure, that's going to be the next video. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.